Hello, beautiful people. Today I am working on a watercolor portrait or a spin on a watercolor portrait. I have been doing what I stated in my Find Your Style video and going back and working on foundations. I have been doing sketches every day for expression and anatomy. And I also want to work on my watercolor skills. So I took a photo that I really loved of the actress who plays the character of Yennefer in The Witcher. I watched this on Netflix. I have not played any of the games. I have not read the books. But I really loved the powerful female character that she played. Very flawed, very interesting things to do and things to accomplish in the world. So I really just loved her character and her presentation of that character. So I decided to take her as a person, an actress, and put her in the place of Rosie the Riveter in the We Can Do It pose. So this is my version of that. And um, yeah, this is my first go at doing a, a proper watercolor portrait. And I'm just gonna work from here. I'm interrupting this program to bring you a specially scheduled public service announcement. This is to talk about one of my favorite things in the whole world in terms of just the existence of the world and creating artwork, and that is the kneaded eraser. See this thing? It's like a little ball of putty. And what makes it really amazing is it's shapeable, so it allows you to get into really tiny areas, get very detailed with what you need. You can, uh, well, it's fun to play with. Also, it doesn't uh, destroy your paper. You can work pretty hard on your line and it doesn't uh, lift or mess up the texture of the paper you're working on. And it leaves the paper super clean. They're super cheap. I would recommend having at least one anywhere you draw. Always have it with you. It's just amazing. Get one for you, get one for all of your friends. I'm telling you. For being a little over a buck a pop, people are gonna love it. And if you can't get them near you, if you don't know where to find them, I'll throw a link down below where you can get, I think, a pack of about four of these, exact same one, for five something about. I mean, when I tell you these last forever, I'm not kidding. I have some that go way back. This one, for all I know, is one of mine that dates back to my college years. They just don't break down. If it looks like there's a lot of pencil and graphite on there, you just sort of work it and it just disappears. It's like brand new and it softens up. This is worth your buck. Get you one. Back to the program.
There is my completed artwork. I have not yet decided if I'm going to go back in and add the text to go with this or any other graphical elements, but this really was meant to be a study and just wet my hands again with using watercolors and getting refreshed in techniques and I have some ways to go, but overall I'm pretty happy and this was fun to work on. So I have a good place to work from after doing this piece. I hope you're doing the same things and working at what you want in the world. So I will see you on the flip side. Stay sane, make things, and I'll see you later.